In this example, I need to find the exact value of the cosecant of 120 degrees. As it says exact value, this means do not use your calculator as that will give you a decimal approximation. We need to use the unit circle that's shown over here. And remember, for every point on the unit circle, the x-coordinate represents the cosine of that angle. The y-coordinate represents the sine of that angle. So in this case, I need to find the cosecant of 120 degrees. Now remember, the cosecant function is just 1 divided by the sine function. So the cosecant of 120 degrees is just 1 divided by the sine of 120 degrees. And is 120 degrees on the unit circle? Yes, it's right here. I need the sine of this angle, so that's the y-coordinate. So the sine of 120 degrees is just the square root of 3 over 2. So I have 1 divided by the square root of 3 over 2. Now how do you divide by a fraction? You multiply by the reciprocal. So you take your numerator of 1, multiply it by the reciprocal of the square root of 3 over 2, which means just flip it upside down, you get 2 divided by the square root of 3. Well, 1 times 2 divided by the square root of 3 is just 2 divided by the square root of 3. If you're not required to rationalize the denominators of your answer, that is one way of writing the answer to the cosecant of 120 degrees. But if you do have to rationalize the denominator, you just multiply numerator and denominator by the square root of 3. So you get 2 times the square root of 3 divided by the square root of 3 times the square root of 3 is the square root of 9, which is 3. So the other way of writing the exact value of the cosecant of 120 degrees is 2 times the square root of 3 divided by 3.